This is our group project for MN325B and we're group 28. I'm Sean. I'm Mary. And our project is based on CAFCAS and we're looking at the HR manager to bar star. So, CAFCAS itself stands for Children, Family, Court, Advisory and Support Service. It was set up in April 2001 and has now become the largest employer of social workers in all of England. And the main areas which they deal with in the courts are divorce and separation, care proceedings and adoption. Well, CAFCAS states that their role is to safeguard and promote the welfare of their children, and give advice to family courts and make provisions for children to be represented. The main aim of CAFCAS is to represent children and their top five strategic objectives to help them achieve their goals are quality, family justice innovation, diversity, efficiency, effectiveness and influence. So the strategic objectives of quality to make further improvements, family justice innovation to implement their part of the family justice reform program and diversity to promote a greater awareness of all dimensions of the child's journey and their family. Efficiency and effectiveness by becoming more resilient by handling higher volumes of work while making savings in the budget this, and influence to use their influence which is huge positively on the child um, so that the child is heard in a family court. The HRM strategy makes sure goals are met and the future needs of the company are adhered to. Human resource manager of CAFCAS, Jabbar Sarr, believed that the HR department did not fulfill the business strategy whatsoever before he was a part of the company. When the CAFCAS budget decreased while workload increased, Sidara saw it positive and states, for me it was never about the budgets. We have 150,000 children to serve, we have to put them first. Sidara st states how it's crucial for him to ask his staff what they have done for, ch for the child each week. He focused on the culture of CAFCAS to lower absence rates, high levels of engagement and high standards as well as innovative thinking. So, in human resource practices in CAFCAS. So, Sar Mr. Sardar joined CAFCAS in 2006, and since then, the human resource department has had a huge change um, in its practices. He realized that the overall performance of CAFCAS was dependent on individual variables. They introduced an employer funded health plan in 2013, and by the summer of 2015, 99% of employees chose to remain in the plan. So due to this healthcare plan and because of the Human Resources Department being more aware of employee health and wellness, um, sickness rates have reduced by 75.2%. Jabbar also made the very important decision of actually listening to his employees by providing healthcare. He boosts employees' loyalty which in turn reduces staff turnover and it inspires a huge amount of employee engagement and lessens the amount of sick days employees have to take. Jabbar Siddhar is a prime example of the benefits of having a director who knows his human resource management and when the suitable strategies are implemented, how brilliantly a company can flourish. Mr. Sardar came to CAFCAS at the right time when they needed a complete overhaul in their HRM practices and strategies. So they went from a company with poor employee morale and the employees didn't feel like Mr. Sardar or CAFCAS cared about their well-being to three quarters of their employees being happy about how much the company care for their well-being. This is seen in their numerous awards and they've uh, received many sector and industry awards including Best Social Worker Employer, Children's Social Worker of the Year, Innovation in Flexible Working and the London Private Law Team was awarded silver for the Team of the Year Children's Services. A fantastic example of CAFCAS's work would be in the baby P trial, which happened in 2007 when an 18 month baby was beaten up for about eight months by his mother and his stepfather. Then Kafka stepped in and they made the investigation. And Jabbar saw that Kafka's social workers weren't fit for the task had to do. So, through all the HRM strategies and everything, he was able to push out the social workers that weren't fit for, for the job keep the ones he wanted, and then he was able to reward them, boost morale, and then overall CAFCAS became a lot better organisation. That's our presentation, and thanks for listening.